much. Right now in Nashville, we've got a fair sky to begin our morning. Warm and muggy out there to start the day, but we are dry across five country at the hour. Heading down to the borough. Good morning. 77 degrees there as we start our old day. And the uh, temps will quickly now with that sunshine push into the 80s. So we're talking near the 90 degree mark by uh, lunchtime for you today outside of where thunderstorms may have popped at that point. Here is a look at the overall setup for today. Warm and muggy into the afternoon, hot with a couple of thunderstorms into the weekend. Scattered showers and storms. There is a front pushing our way. That front will bring a little relief as far as temperatures go and also knock that humidity down a bit. But then into next week, we'll keep an eye on what Fred happens to do. Our weather kit is ready. Got the short sleeves, but also with the umbrella in case he is in a shower or a thunderstorm today. This is Kate and Rainey. Kate and showing 77 degrees this morning and then 93 into the afternoon here in Nashville. Yeah, 93 upper 80s, Cookville, Crossville, Fayetteville, 90, 91 in the Queen City and back over in Camden along the Tennessee River right around the 90 degree mark. Williamson County Fair getting ready to wrap up tonight and tomorrow. Uh, it's 90 degrees at 5 o'clock, so there may be a few hit and miss showers and storms. Uh, and then later tonight, there's still that storm threat, but the chances for rain do go down as we get later into the night. 90 at 5 o'clock and then 78 at 11 p.m. Update on Fred. Fred right now. 35 miles per hour along the coast of Cuba, but hitting that warmer water, the Florida Strait will allow it to regain tropical storm status. Here's the projected path through the early part of the weekend, and then notice by next week, by Wednesday, it could have an impact in our area. So we're still several days out. A lot can change, but just something uh, to be mindful of going into next week. Right now, though, for us, not much happening on the power of five, but a storm or two later today into the night could be on the strong side. Got a couple of things. There's one that's dying out there. There's that's one closer to the actual cold front, and it's that front that again helps to kind of spark even more of those scattered showers and storms this weekend. This one here is actually the back boundary that died down from those early morning storms. It may help be the focal point for a few more showers and storms firing back up today. Your seven day 93 today, 90 tomorrow, 89 on Sunday. And then again, we'll keep an eye on the impact that Fred may have our way next week. Here is our weather artist uh, for you for today. This is from Kang, a third grader there. Again, we would love to feature your weather art on News Channel 5. It's the same email address for school of the day, school at newschannel5.com.